So, I'm on my way to a survey, but I've passed this building. Uh, it's not even our building, but uh, take a look at what they've done. So there is obviously dampness to this wall, uh, and they've rendered this wall, which has effectively bridged the damp course. What that means is that the render uh, is now a path for the water to rise, uh, it rises up the wall, behind the render, and uh, taking the render. So typically, uh, rising damp comes up about a metre, so we're about here, um, but you can see through the dark bricks that it's pushed the damp even higher. Um, it's over my head height, which I know some of you will say that's not very high. However, you uh, can see all the dampness in here, so this is an incorrect way of treating rising damp. To have render inside and render outside means that the dampness passes further up in between the brickwork uh, because it's got nowhere to evaporate. So it's render inside only and allow the moisture to evaporate outside is the correct way. But maybe I should knock on, see if they need my help. Uh, that's not going to help either. 